I wanted to be an example for the young girls. I also wanted to be um, a supporter of women in this race. And I also feel that I wanted to do it for those who have done it ahead of us. Um, I believe that as a female, we must have some sort of represent, um, representation within the party, and hence the reason I decided to do this. Also, I want to address some of the concerns that I've been hearing while walking around. I think that these can only be done through the experiences that we have, knowing that you have also passed through them. And once you have passed through a particular experience, it's always good for you to make them better. Um, some of the concerns that we have is actually um, job creation in Dangriga. People have been asking about that. It's no, um, no question at the back of our head. It's a concern also in the, the, the wider population. However, in Dangriga, um, I'm looking at offering training assistance for individuals, empowering them through education, um, looking at infrastructure, not really infrastructure in terms of the street, but rather infra infrastructure in terms of helping individuals with their in the, um, education and skill building. Through this medium, I believe that we'll be able to empower young people, we'll be able to empower women, we'll be able to empower men. They themselves will then become creative. And as long as that creativity exists, they will be able to make jobs for themselves and later hire individuals. The people who have been campaigning to are telling me is that, one, they have elected me, and I was actually the only female, or rather the only POP councillor that got in, and um, they believe that this job is for me. I can do, and I can make a difference. Um, I'm also considering myself as a minority councillor. Um, through this medium, it's kind of difficult for me to do a lot. Hence the reason I um, decided to set my hat in this um, race.